Jim Crow blues was inspired by Lead Belly. Um, like I said, I'm into all types of music. That's a, that's a blues record when you hear it. This is honest to God blues record. Uh, we get into all types of music in Young World, and that song is just about uh, the segregation, like between classes. Lead Belly had a song called Jim Crow Blues, and it was just, you know it was about obviously the laws that you that by law kept black people uh, out of the out of society's opportunities. By law, you couldn't do certain things. It was meant to keep them as a permanent social underclass. And I think in our world today, race is still a factor, but I think about class a lot more. So I wrote that song basically saying we still have Jim Crow laws. Those are the things that in our society in America that keep the poor poor and keep the people on top in power. And it is meant to keep you in a life of servitude. Whether you're so poor that you're part of your oppressed, maybe you're like a suburban kid, middle class, adult, stuck in a job for their life basically working, you know, a working slave, you know, where you're, you're repressed, they keep you where you're so scared of losing your job or losing your money that you don't ever want to stand up for what you know is right. And so I think we got a world where we continually do that to people, and it's not just black people, it's all types of people. Our messages and our music in Young World is not for any, any race, any class, any group, it's music that everybody should be able to hear and, and feel like the truth in it and say, man, this is really, this is really expressing something I feel, you know, whatever your age or, you know, whatever your categorization. So Jim Crow Blues is about how we have these two classes, you know, like the rich are getting richer, and it's the, the, the group of the poor is becoming larger and larger. So that's all that's about. Good news, right?